Hi, Scotty Sanders here. I want to share with you about something I developed called the Overwhelmed Equation in three ways that you can increase your capacity. In our fast-paced world, overwhelm seems to have become really this common state of being, you know, another way of saying is I'm crazy busy all the time. It's the never-ending to-do list, the constant task, and the unceasing demands on your time that will leave you feeling like you're drowning in responsibilities. You can probably relate to that. I know there's times I certainly can. So the overwhelm equation will guide you toward a more productive and balanced life. And listen, the goal isn't really to get a balanced life because we never get total balance, but what we don't want to do is live in overwhelm in this crazy busyness. So understanding the overwhelmed equation, let's talk about that. So the overwhelm equation is simple, is simple but very enlightening and it breaks down the causes of being overwhelmed into three key elements. And that is one, capacity, two, load, and three, margin. So capacity refers to your energy, ability to tackle work before uh, you, you move on to something else. It's about recognizing your limitations and strengths and understanding how much you can realistically handle without sacrificing your well-being. That's your capacity. So the load is the work allocated are required of you and everybody has different loads but it's the sum of all the tasks and responsibilities and commitments that make up your daily life it's crucial to assess your load accurately to prevent it from surpassing your capacity and that's where we get in the margin see margin is the space between your capacity and your load it's much like the margins on a page this is the area that provides room to breathe and reflect and adapt. But when your load exceeds your capacity, your margin shrinks and overwhelm sets in. So I want to talk to you about increasing your capacity. And the key to overcoming overwhelm lies in increasing your capacity. So this is very important. If you want to have more margin, more freedom, you want to pay attention to this. So here are three powerful strategies to expand your capacity and regain control of your life. Number one, be clear on what's important to you. What is your purpose? What are you passionate about? What are your priorities daily and, and just as part of your life, those values? So defi this defining what truly matters to you will significantly enhance your capacity. Align your actions with your purpose, nurture your passions, and establish clear priorities. If you don't do that, you're gonna be going in a thousand different directions. So this really helps you to be aiming at the right target in life. Here's the second one. Get comfortable with being uncomfortable. See, growth occurs outside of your comfort zone. So embrace challenges and uncertainty as opportunities to expand your capabilities. Stepping out of your comfort zone allows you to develop resilience, adaptability, and new skills. And then the third skill that you need related or strategy to help you to expand your capacity is multiply time. And that you do that by study. See, when you study, you're multiplying your time in the future. One hour study today could be worth five hours in the future. And self-discipline. While you can't physically create more hours in a day, you can multiply the impact of the time you have. So dedicate time to continuous learning and self-improvement. Strengthen your self-discipline to manage your tasks efficiently. So transforming overwhelm into productivity and freedom by understanding the overwhelmed equation, taking initial steps and intentional steps to increase your capacity you can regain control of your life and thrive in a world often feels chaotic. Remember, it's not about doing more, but it's about creating the space and the energy to do what truly matters. So expand your capacity and watch overwhelm give way to productivity, balance, and freedom. So I've got a free resource for you that will help you to kind of get your aim in the right direction it's called the Purpose Accelerator. So I have a link that you can check out, click on it, it's a free resource. It will really help you to aim in the right direction in life. Well, listen, until next time, live well and lead well.